Hello, Diecast fans, and welcome to another brand new episode of Jim's Magnificent Miniature Motor Cars. For this episode, we will be unboxing this lovely looking pop race the Skyline GTR V8, aka the Hakusuka. Without any further ado, let us proceed with the unboxing. Right. Wow, there she blows. <clears throat> Okay, wow. That looks properly wild. Oh yeah. Look at that. So all right, I confess to not knowing a whole lot about this car when I pre-ordered it. And so in the search for pictures of it, it's real life counterpart. I have to say I was very intrigued by what I saw because this is basically a 1971 Skyline GTR, which as GTR nuts or anyone with a working knowledge of the history of the GTR would know, came with an inline six engine back in the day. Or if not an inline six engine, certainly not this thing that's tucked in here. What is in here right now is a V8 taken straight out of a NASCAR race car. Okay, so this car is taken to drift by a very famous Japanese professional drifter, Daigo Saito, I think it is. Anyway, here's a pic of his car. Yeah, so as you can see, because Pop Race isn't obsessed with reproducing the negative camber that these drift cars almost inevitably come in. This doesn't have negative camber. But what it does have are rolling wheels, okay? Opening parts. So you got an opening bonnet and an opening trunk. All right, or an opening boot. And you have this lovely engine detailing. Yeah. So all of that for a very reasonable price. You even got there, you got a little bit of brake disc assembly, if I'm not mistaken. And some nice, lovely interior details like this roll, roll cage. So in short, folks, even though this car set me back about uh, 750 Philippine pesos, it's still very much worth what I spent. Oops, sorry about that, folks. Okay, so in my humble opinion, this merits a 10 out of 10. It's very stylized, I'll admit. It's very, very stylized. It's not everyone's, it won't be everyone's cup of tea. But for the degree of replication that Pop Race have managed here, yep, I sincerely believe they deserve a 10 out of 10. And that's it for this unboxing, our very first for the month of March. I hope you folks enjoyed this episode. If you like what you see and you're new to the channel, please consider giving me a like and a subscribe and hitting that notification bell. 